The N3 toll concession says no further snowfall has been reported at Van Rienens Pass on the N3 between Durban and Johannesburg. Earlier, it reported heavy snowfall in the area with similar conditions between Van Rienens and Warden in the Free State, with possibly slippery and dangerous roads. The South African Weather Service issued a level 4 warning on Saturday of disruptive snowfall over the Drakensberg. And officials are asking travellers to keep emergency supplies in their vehicles. And listen carefully, this includes warm clothing, blankets, a cell phone charger, as well as a torch. And the N3 toll concession is appealing to motorists to be extra careful on the roads. There is an emergency number which uh, we will ho hopefully flash to you, 0800 634357, 0800 634357. All right. Up next is uh, weather with Mpoh. Um, you know, Mpoh, my dad used to be a truck driver on that Van Rienen's uh, route. It is treacherous. It is a notorious stretch of road. And I can only imagine how it must be exponentially so under these adverse weather conditions. So really, if you're a trucker, especially a trucker out there, just be careful uh, as you hit those roads, right? Definitely, definitely, because we're expecting the conditions to actually continue actually uh, being worse, but only for the next coming days. And that is when we're expecting the weather actually to be uh, more severe because of those that cut off flow that has been causing all those heavy rainfall and also all those snowfalls that we're expecting over most of the country uh, that for today is uh, stretching towards tomorrow and also stretching towards uh, Wednesday. Now, so let's look at what's causing all this rainfall that we're seeing over the country. Now, firstly, we had a... a a strong surface a tr uh, surface high which was reaching in into the southern parts of the country bringing moisture uh, from the ocean stretching it into uh, South Africa and also we had the cut of flow that, was, that developed over the central parts of the country that is bringing instability and also as we see this heavy rainfall and also severe thunderstorm and lastly we had the lowering of an altitude which means it we get sub-zero temperatures which you cause freezing temperatures that is why we had all those snowfalls now that combined with the cut of flow is dropping temperature significantly over most of the country. Now we're talking about disruptive snowfalls uh, that has been experienced, especially over Free State and KwaZulu-Natal. And also we have uh, the drop of data, uh, daytime temperatures, that's maximum temperatures, meaning that during the day it becomes very cold. And also those severe thunderstorms which may be accompanied by large amount of uh, damaging hail and also heavy downpours which will lead to localized flooding, especially over Gauteng and also stretching into Mpumalanga. And also we have those strong and damaging surface and coastal winds, mostly over the coastal areas, especially over the Northern Cape and also parts of the Western Cape. Now looking at tonight's conditions, we do expect up to 80% chance of showers and thunder showers up north over Gauteng, Pumalanga and Limpopo. Tomorrow that 80% is only, only expected over Mpumalanga, Gauteng and also the Northwest and Limpopo. 60% chance of showers and thunder showers over the central parts is just isolated uh, for tomorrow. Looking at some warnings, we've talked about those damaging winds over the coastal areas and into uh, that interior. We're taking wind speed of up to 40 kilometers per hour and can cast 45 kilometers per hour. Snow, for, snow is expected over the high lying areas over the Eastern Cape stretching into uh, parts of the uh, of Kozul Natal. Now it is a level 2 meaning disruptive rainfall uh, uh, snowfalls rather, which means that some passes can be close and also it makes it difficult actually while we're driving over the free state and also parts of Kozul Natal. Morning fog patch is also expected over Kozul Natal and the Eastern Cape which means that visibility will be reduced. For tomorrow we have a level 2 warning of severe thunderstorm over Gauteng stretching into the northwest and parts of Mpumalanga and Limpopo. That's why we have possibilities of hail and also heavy downpours. Now talking about heavy downpours we have we still have a level 2 warning of damaging uh, of destructive rainfall over Mpumalanga. Remember this is where we had that 80% chance of showers and thunder showers over Mpumalanga stretching into parts of Kozul Natal. Flooding is a possibility over those places for tomorrow. Now, temperature wise, expecting yet another cold night for tonight with two over Bethlehem, five over Johannesburg, 10 over Poloqua. Now, tomorrow, very important, especially here over Gauteng, we might have a maximum of 11, but it will feel like a five. Yes, it will be very cold tomorrow over Gauteng because of those windy conditions. So please, let's dress warmly and stay warm as we are indoors. Overall, expecting mostly cool conditions as you move up north, especially over Poloqua with a high of 16. That's all the weather I have for you. Stay tuned.